Greetings, Commander. Today we have a treat for you, a special edition of the unit breakdown video dedicated not to one, but 10 new and exciting units. Let's get right into it. Out of the 10 units that Festival of Veils introduces, five are common, three rare, and two are mythic. All of these units belong to two or more factions and possess formidable weapons to bring into battle. Let's take a closer look. Clockwork Guardians belong to both Construct and Order faction. They are immune to the plague and cannot be stunned. While slightly weaker than Shield Bearers, they do have the numbers advantage. Spirit Panthers of Order and Nature factions is another great frontline unit. This high damage fast unit excels against weaker targets and it rapidly regenerates health. Frost Knights, Guardians of Order and Chaos freeze enemy units with each melee hit. This allows them to not only serve as effective meat shields, but to amplify the damage of the back row units. Chaos Archers are constructs built with bone and magic. Unlike normal archers, they do not try to focus fire and shoot at the same enemy. Instead, each archer in the group fires at a random target. Lightning Spire is a new tool for those that love building impenetrable fortresses. Lightning Spire zaps enemies within its range with bolts of electricity that bounce and seek new targets. While Spire does little damage, it stuns all the enemies it hits, making them easy prey for the rest of your army. Nature Faction gained another defensive unit from its alliance with the Constructs. Spirit Shield Generator creates a protective barrier that blocks enemy ranged attacks. Spirit Shield Barrier does not regenerate over time, but rather it gets powered by each skull that Spirit Shield Generator consumes during the course of battle. Necromancer puts the skulls of fallen units to better use. Using ancient rituals and remains of fallen heroes, he is able to summon whole units of undead warriors. Each of his casts summons groups of 1 to 5 skeletons to his aid. Living Bark is a sturdy unit. Saplings of the ancient tree are masters of adaptation and heal 5% of their health every time they are hit with a melee attack. Now if you want the true power, take a look at these last units. Celestial Spear is a child of order and chaos. This unit has one of the longest ranges in the game and does extremely high damage. Spear penetrates protective barriers and will be a huge threat to armies with low unit counts. Unlike most ranged units, Celestial Spear is tough and can withstand a lot of punishment. Last, but definitely not least, the Miracle or the Abomination, how you will see it very much dependent on which side of the battlefield you will see this beast. This unit is very large and towers over others dominating the battlefield. It shoots lasers that set your foes ablaze and fires mortar shells that will leave your opponents frozen with terror. If anyone is foolish enough to get close, mechanical horror powerful gyro claws will rip and fling those fools away. What a list! Have you seen or used the new units on the battlefield? What unit should we cover in our next unit breakdown video? Let us know in the comments down below. Thank you for watching and happy spinning!